<laughs> You're watching TTT Boxing in association with IFL TV and KO Clothing. I'm here joined by Sydney Premier Astrid van der Sluis ahead of her professional amateur card tomorrow night in North Sydney. Thanks for joining us, Astrid. Thanks, Tommy. Weigh-in's done. The stress of organising everyone is over. <laughs> how, uh, how, how are you feeling ahead of tomorrow's show? Yeah, good. Good. It's, it's done now. Uh, everyone's having a bite to eat and a drink, and um, we're good. Go. Almost everyone. Obviously, amateur side of the show tomorrow. Yes. They've, they've got a weigh in tomorrow morning. Yeah. But um, so, weigh in's all done. Everybody made weight. A few people on the treadmill last minute, but they all, all made it fairly comfortably. Yeah. Um, is there any, any of the fights tomorrow night that you're looking forward to in particular? We're looking forward to all of them, actually. Uh, it's another one of those cards where we're not going to bet on any fights or say who's going to win because I think it's all going to go down to the wire. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with all the matchups and I've got no idea how it's going to go. And for you know, for those people that are coming along or who are thinking about it, we've got Paul Ogadenby yep. headlining the show. Very much a, a knockout artist. 5-0, yes. and o, 5 KOs. Are yeah. you uh, expecting to see more fireworks from Paul? He's a local lad. He's got a big crowd around yeah. here. He yeah, always yeah, likes to impress. So, yeah, look, he's fighting a Kiwi guy. Um, he's a Lele Far. Uh, he's equally as dangerous. Um, it's going to be a good fight. Um, Absolutely. Yeah. We'll yeah. See, how, see how it goes. But yeah, so North Sydney Leagues Club uh, tickets will be on the door, especially for all the local people that are wanting to come on and support Paul. Excellent. So I know there's um, so obviously a lot of local fighters on the amateur show yes. as well. Yep. Um, so for yeah, for those who are thinking about it, what's what's on the card in terms of how many how many amateur fights, how many professional yep. fights, and, and when can people turn up? Yep. Okay. So we have five pro fights. Um, so Paul's main event, but we've got some absolutely cracking fights beneath that as well. Um, I think we've got a couple of Muay Thai fighters um, that are very, very talented Muay Thai fighters that are having either debuts or they're quite uh, early on into the boxing side of things, and um, and they're in against debutants. So there's a whole lot of debutants on the card. Um, Alpa Osman, who has been a two times New South Wales state champ, yeah, um, and he's jumping in against um, Got Sanoi and. Queensland. He's uh, out of 42 fights, he's won 36 of those, and plenty of them have been by knockout. So quite a dangerous fight for Alps to be taking first yeah, round. Yeah. Um, yeah. Other than that, look, there's a there's a, a good mix of debutants, some experience, and it's going to be a great card. Yeah, and um, and, the, and the debutants bring in that sort of element of unexpectedness, element yes, of excitement. Yeah, you know, absolutely. they're often. Yeah, you know, keen to impress on that on that first show, yeah, and, and we see some you know very exciting sort of first round. So yeah. could uh, could be very very interesting. Yeah. And um, I know there's some some amateur titles yeah. as well. Yeah. Um, so how, how's your weight looking, Tommy? <laughs> my weight's not <laughs> not looking too great. I've um, yeah a, bit, a few kilos to go before tomorrow morning, which I'm not looking yeah. forward to tonight. <laughs> um, away from away from myself, uh, I know you've got say a couple of titles uh, yeah, fights yeah. going on. Hakam Saglam who. An old coach of mine is, yeah. is fighting for one of the titles. Yeah, so, so he's fighting for a WBF Masters title. Uh, we've also got, uh, so he's going in against Dimitri, the Dominator, uh, Pats, uh, from Liverpool PCYC. And look, that's going to be a really entertaining fight. Again, don't know which way it's going to go. Um, I'm really excited to see the Masters go at it. And we've, um, we've also got another Masters fight between Artie Kalkides uh, against Peter Schutram, who's stepping up a weight class in the super heavyweight division. What? Again, for a belt. Um, but one of the most exciting amateur fights is going to be between Kay Scott, who just won silver over yeah. at World Titles. Um, she's gone back down to her natural weight class of 75 kilos, and she's fighting the number one from New Zealand. So, so um, look, I can't wait to see The trans-Tasman battle. Yeah, absolutely. I cannot wait to see that fight. Um, there you go. Yeah, so yeah, really, I, know, really I know a few people that train with, with Kay and always telling me how impressive she is, so it'd be good to uh, say yeah. see that in the... Uh, in the flesh. She, she was always nice to me when we were sparring. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. I'll see if we can dig out some old footage somewhere. But, um, but look, I know you're probably keen to, uh, to get off. It's been a stressful afternoon getting everybody in and, and ready. And uh, obviously a lot to do before tomorrow. Yeah. So I uh, wish you all the best. We'll catch up with you tomorrow. Fingers crossed I will, uh, I'll make weight. <laughs> and uh, and I'll, um, I'll, I'll see you after the fight. Sounds good. All right. Cheers, Astrid. Thanks. Thanks, Tommy. Good luck.